Welcome to Waypoint X. My name is Judd, and we're going to give you a 2022 update on what's been going on and why we haven't been making many videos. So stay tuned. Welcome back, guys. My name is Judd, like I said earlier, and I know we have not had a lot of videos out in the past two months. Um, it's been really crazy around here. So just to give you a brief rundown and then we'll explain the bike behind us. Uh, not only have we been racing a little bit, riding a little bit, um, but we've been in the process of selling our house and buying a new one, uh, basically January, February, now into March. Um, and uh, we're closing this month. And that's that's really exciting time in Caitlin and I's life. Uh, just kind of moving out of the house that we started our marriage in um, and uh, getting, getting a, a, a little bit bigger place, bigger garage to do more Jeep projects in. Um, and then I tore my ACL. Uh, so I stepped off wrong, tore my ACL on my right knee. Um, actually, at the time of this video, I'll be going into surgery in the morning. I've got to be there bright and early at 5. And so um, it's just kind of been a long journey this uh, 2022 season. Uh, 2020, 2021 did not stop. It just kept on bringing on, bringing on the chaos. So that's kind of where we're at. But behind us uh, is a 2021 YZ450F. And uh, we had a 2020 YZ450F. We actually blew up the motor. And we'll show you some videos of that bike. And uh, we're actually going to post another video outside of this video of that bike blowing up. Um, it threw the rod right out of the front of the motor. Um, catastrophic failure. Um, kind of crazy. We were out for a while. I did not get to do the uh, Arena Cross series. My brother let us loan, he loaned us his bike, his uh, 2021, I believe it might be a 22, uh, KTM uh, 250SXF. Uh, we did a few arena crosses with it, did some outdoor training with it, and was getting this bike. And we got this bike from Cernix up in Pennsylvania, our good friend Jared Hicks. Um, was able to go up there and get it because he was getting a bike for himself and just so happened they had a, a brand new YZ450 up there. And we decided to pull the trigger on it just because we can't find parts for our 2020 to rebuild it just yet. So it's going to take time just because of the supply chain issues. So uh, we do want to give a little plug to the people that are helping us out. Like I said, Waypoint X, because that's who we are. We want to we want to represent us as much as we can. We have Riders Harley Davidson out in Trustville, Alabama. So if you're looking for a street bike, definitely go check them out. Uh, like I said, Cernix up in Pennsylvania. Um, they have all kind of bikes, definitely check them out. Uh, really easy to work with and let them know that uh, Judd with Waypoint X sent you. Uh, you have a chair beast that did all our plastics. Uh, Liette um, did our neck braces and things of that nature. GoPro, got the cameras, and then Backyard Designs did all the graphics. And appreciate Serenix for hooking us up with the graphics. Thank you. Uh, also, we have Twin Air Dunlop with the tires. Uh, Twin Air does our air filters. Um, I believe, oh, lead off road and performance. Thank y'all, appreciate y'all. A uh, little plug for them. Uh, really appreciate them. And Ogeo, they help us out with all our gear bags. I think that's it. Isn't it right, Kayla? I think that's it. Uh, I think we're naming off everybody. But uh, we really want to appreciate all those people that are helping us out um, with this bike. Um, but, yeah, that's kind of where we're at. We got the 20. We're going to rebuild the 2022, like I said. Um, uh, but uh, we were about to go race outdoor. The beginning of outdoor season started uh, this Saturday at uh, our local race in McClarty's. Um, and we were going to just do a few uh, races here and there. Like I said, toward my ACL, and it's all gone. <laughs> it's been bad. So, but we, we want to say that we're not done with the Jeep. The Jeep content's still coming. I promise you. Uh, we just haven't been wheeling that much at the beginning of 2022. We're still going to be doing the axle swap. So we're doing one-ton axles. We're going to be doing new drive shafts, new wheels and tires. So all that will be coming. Um, we're just figuring, figuring out the logistics on how that's going to happen. I know we're going to rewire the Jeep. As far as all the accessories, lights, uh, lockers, things of that nature, we need to spruce that up a little bit. And just a little bit of TLC on the Jeep as well. Um, most of the Jeep content that will be coming out in the next two to uh, three, four months, just because of my knee, we don't want to injure it any more than it already is injured. And so getting out on the trail in and out of the Jeep is just probably not the best for the knee. We're going to be doing a lot of review videos, such as tires, wheels, drive shafts, things of that, that, of that nature, a long-term reviews where you know you kind of you've, you've seen us wield these all these um, products for so long now we're going to give reviews on them and they're going to be accurate reviews we're not going to 
uh, cherry coated or anything like that. We're gonna tell you if we liked it, we didn't like it, good pros and cons of, of all those products. So definitely be on the lookout for those. Um, but man, we really do appreciate all the support. Please hit that like button, leave us a comment, uh, hit that bell for notifications, and hit, please subscribe. That really helps us out um, and, and just viewing our content. We have a ton of content. I know we haven't put out very much in the last two months, but go look at all that old content, man. We have Moab, Rubicon Trail, um, Arkansas, Texas, you name it. There's a ton of great content out there, so go check all, out all those videos. And like I said, when you hit that subscribe button, hit that bell because we'll send out all notifications to your email address. And that way you'll know when we have a new video out. Um, so that's uh, that's our 2022 update. Uh, it's been a crazy, crazy year thus far. We just have a lot going on. We really do appreciate it. So like I said, just uh, hit that subscribe button, leave us a like, leave us a comment. We want to hear from you. We want to help you out. If you have any Jeep-related questions or off-roading questions, recovery questions, you name it. Um, we really do appreciate it, guys. Oh, also, Rhino USA. want to help say that. They, they helped us all with all our recovery gear. Um, so we just got to give a, a little plug for them. Rusty's Off-Road. They're great. Uh, we're just trying to thank everybody that's helping us out. Who did I leave out? Caitlin, did I leave out anybody? Adam's Drive Shafts. Um, man, Arrow Lids. Got to give a shout-out to them. Um, so we just want to thank everybody that's helped us out. Uh, so we do appreciate it. I hope y'all have a wonderful 2022 and hope that y'all will come back and watch more videos from us. Um, we really do appreciate it. Y'all have a great day.